But what did she actually do? Marie Skwodowska Curie was a groundbreaking female physicist at the turn of the 20th century. She was the first woman ever to be awarded a Nobel Prize, the first person ever to be awarded a second Nobel Prize, and the first of only two people still to be awarded Nobel Prizes in more than one field of science. But what did she actually do? Marie coined the term radioactivity after studying pitchblende, which is essentially uranium ore. She realized that pitchblende itself was far more radioactive than the uranium that came out of it. And this led her to the discovery of two new elements that were also super radioactive, polonium and radium. Her work with radioactivity forced scientists to completely shift the way they viewed the physical world. Theories about atoms as the smallest particles of matter already existed, but Marie's work with ionizing radiation, what she called radioactivity, meant that there were particles even smaller than atoms. Elements that release ionizing radiation have unstable atoms. They break down or fall apart, releasing particles. This very concept meant that atoms themselves could not be the smallest particles, leading to theories about subatomic particles, protons, neutrons, electrons, and opening the door to understanding how everything in our universe works. On top of all that, Marie shattered an incredibly low glass ceiling for female scientists in order to achieve this, and she remained remarkably humble despite her success. She refused to patent the radium isolation process she developed, although it would have made her incredibly rich, because she wanted other scientists to have access to the technology. During World War I, she put her work on hold, bringing mobile x-ray machines to field hospitals that saved countless lives. For this, she received no recognition from the French government. She went even further, donating her Nobel Prize money to the war effort and even attempting to donate the gold Nobel Prize medals themselves, although they were refused. Fellow physicist Albert Einstein reportedly said that Marie was perhaps the only person who could not be corrupted by fame. Join me for a special mini fix episode of History Fix to learn more about this remarkable woman. Only on patreon.com slash historyfixpodcast.